Hello friends. Today's topic is photosynthesis. Learning objectives. In this module, you will learn about what is photosynthesis, chemical equation of photosynthesis, raw materials for photosynthesis, and the product of photosynthesis. Among all living organisms in the world, only green plants can prepare their own food by the process of photosynthesis. Now, let us understand what is photosynthesis. The process by which green plants prepare their own food by using carbon dioxide and water in the presence of sunlight and chlorophyll is called photosynthesis. Now this process can be represented in the form of chemical equation carbon dioxide plus water in the presence of sunlight and chlorophyll gives glucose plus oxygen. This can be seen in the form of formula 6CO2 plus 6H2O in the presence of sunlight and chlorophyll gives the product C6H12O6 plus 6 molecules of oxygen. Now let us know what are the raw materials required for photosynthesis. Since food is synthesized in the leaves, all the raw materials need to reach there. The first raw material is water and minerals. These are absorbed by the roots from the soil. From here, water and minerals are transported to other parts of the plants by the vessels. The vessels are tubes that run throughout the root, the stem, the branches and leaves. The second raw material is carbon dioxide. Plants take carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. Carbon dioxide enters the leaves through tiny pores present on the surface of leaves. Such pores are called stomata. The stomata are surrounded by special cells called guard cells. This helps in the opening and closing of stomata. The next raw material is sunlight. Sunlight is the light and energy that comes from the sun. During photosynthesis, plants use the energy of sunlight to prepare food. That is why the food making process in plant is called photosynthesis. Photo means light, synthesis means to combine. The fourth raw material is chlorophyll. The leaves are green in color due to the presence of pigment called chlorophyll. It helps the leaf to capture the solar energy. This energy is used to prepare food from carbon dioxide and water. So leaves are also known as food factories of the plant. Now let us know the product of photosynthesis. After photosynthesis, the initial product formed is a carbohydrate called glucose. It gets converted to starch whose presence in the leaves 
indicates the occurrence of photosynthesis so photosynthesis is a unique process it supplies food directly or indirectly for all living organisms goodbye